is up guys this is Tito back with another video on the Redmi K20 Pro and today in this video I'm going to be showing you how to switch to the Evolution X ROM from the Pixel Experience ROM and if it's actually possible because the Pixel Experience ROM as you guys know is based on the OSS vendor and the Evolution X ROM is based on the MIUI 11 vendor so can we switch between those let's try so I have downloaded the latest like Evolution X ROM I'll try to flash the firmware first and then flash the ROM with a script disabler and see if it actually works. So right now, let's just reboot to the recovery. I do have the Orange Fox recovery installed. So here, as you can see, I have successfully booted into the Orange Fox recovery now and I have done total backup to my PC. So if you are doing this, make sure you have a backup on your PC if something goes wrong. And now let's just go to wipe. I'll just wipe Dalvik, cache, system, vendor and data select all of these and like swipe to wipe now here let's go to your download folder and the firmware wherever it is i will flash this 11.0.4 the latest rafael in firmware because this is a redmi k20 pro indian unit so i'll choose this firmware then add to queue then i'll choose the latest evolution x 4.0 rom and here as you can see this is the 8th march 2020 build and now add to queue and I'll select the fcrypt disabler 2 and right now I have selected this reboot after installation is complete so I'll just swipe to install and let's see what happens the ROM flashing is done so it's rebooting now it also flashed the fcrypt disabler of course now the moment of truth shows the redmi logo and it shows the boot animation so there you go i think you can definitely switch between the pixel experience rom which is based on the oss vendor to this evolution x rom just like this which needs the miui 11 vendor or firmware so there you have it this is how you can switch between the evolution x and pixel experience rom on the redmi k20 pro and here i have the setup wizard i just need to complete the setup now so here we are successfully booted into the home screen and as you can see this is just like restoring my google app data backup right now let's just go into the about phone section let's just like disable the dark theme so that you guys can see it better in the android version we have the evolution x logo and what i'm noticing is that like the accent color kind of looks green so yeah the evolution x is actually going green and here we have the version and you can definitely see this version right look at the name of this version 4.2.0 <laughs> ganja official so yeah pretty much it and the security patch is of latest like april 5th 2020 if you notice the stock kernel this is the fixie kernel and the build date over here is the april like 8th 2020 build and of course we have the evolver and stuff and the most interesting thing is that we have the face unlock let's try it so right now let's just like all right it detected through this all oh, okay and now let's try to unlock all right so here this is a really like interesting thing for me let's just all right so where is the double tap to sleep i think i have to reboot once to like make the double tap to sleep and stuff working and just notice the gestures over here there's many features you get block height of virtual keyboard then show an animated arrow for back gesture hide the gesture bar pill if you want that and enable haptic tick effect on back gesture okay seems pretty nice to have these kind of customizations and yes the evolution x of course does have a lot more customizations than the pixel experience rom i'll show those like later on but this is how you can switch to the evolution x rom and pretty much enjoy but let's try the like face unlock one more time so yeah like if you press the power button from here or just double tap as you can see it all right so it unlocks like this you don't have to swipe up like the pixel experience from over here as you're noticing i am not swiping up let's try it again okay so it unlocks i unlock too many times so it says you are opening the front camera just too many times too frequently so yeah not gonna open it anymore but here let's try with the nx camera if the like 960 fps and stuff is working slow motion let's try whatever subject or object 
slow motion just keeps rotating okay all right so this 960p slow mo and stuff is actually working over here as you can see so yeah i can definitely recommend you guys flashing this evolution x rom over pixel experience right now because it has these kind of features let's see if it has the like 4k video option so actually it has the 4k 60fps video option too so this is really great that we have all of these things if you are noticing it shows 4k uhd over here so that's been it guys thank you so much for watching this video give it a thumbs up if it actually helped you and subscribe to the channel if you want more contents on the redmi k20 pro and other devices this is t signing off for today and i'll be catching you guys in the next one bye bye now